Tonight, we are hearing from the family of the 22-year-old employee. Police say that he was killed by a co-worker. CBS 2's Lisa Rosner has the details. He was just trying to just do his job. That's all he was trying to do. A sister of 22-year-old Brandon Almonte is devastated. His job was to take pictures of cars for sale at the Riverdale Chrysler dealer located on Broadway. His stepfather says Monday afternoon after Almonte parked a car, a co-worker in the service department, 53-year-old Jose Almodovar, got upset. Brandon, I guess, put a vehicle there where it wasn't supposed to be. And they got into a confrontation, you know, heated argument, whatever, and it was broken up. Jose was stating to other employees that I'm going to kill this guy, you know, that uh, he had a knife. They were aware that he had a knife and what his intent was. NYPD sources disagree with that account and say the suspect got upset he saw Brandon in an employee's only area and may have not recognized him since the victim recently transferred to the Riverdale dealership. Police say around 4.30 p.m., Almodovar stabbed his co-worker multiple times in the neck. Other employees say the alleged stabber has a history of being confrontational. So I don't understand why they didn't get rid of him a long time ago. Brandon's family tells me he was saving up to go to pilot school, working here and also as an Uber driver. He's a good kid, you know, kept himself, never harmed nobody. Almodovar is being held on murder and other charges. The family is asking witnesses to speak with police. We want justice for our family and for Brandon. When we tried to speak with the supervisor at the dealership, he told us it was an unfortunate situation, but couldn't comment any further. In the Riverdale section of the Bronx, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. At last check, the suspect was in the hospital after being taken into custody.